I don't know if I am a great leader first of all, but <laughs> the qualities uh, I see I am able to delegate, uh, uh, trust people and give them ownership. I think that is what uh, we do. People are attached to projects uh, like it is their baby and uh, we give due credits for that. Also when we have uh, the first, pro when the project comes in, uh, there is a small competition in the office for each of the projects and people come in with their ideas. It has to be an overnight uh, idea. We believe in this first gut reaction that comes uh, to take that further. It should not be too much of mind applied. So these are discussed openly and there is a secret vote. People vote for the, the best uh, idea and uh, we take one or two of them the first two and uh, develop them into a design and present it to the, the clients. So in that way everybody feels uh, that they are completely involved, they feel it was their idea which went ahead and uh, so I think that that's what we have been able to do. We were about five years old and uh, there was a senior of mine who visited uh, our office. He came because he had heard a little bit about us winning competitions, etc. So he was about uh, 15 years senior to me and uh, he came visiting, he saw the projects. Uh, every time I exp he asked me what is what's happened with the project, uh, I said it got abandoned. Second project, uh, we didn't win this one, third project something else happened. So it was very natural for us to explain that this is happening. But what he noticed was that none of our buildings were getting completed. So we had no buildings uh, by the end of five years. And uh, he said uh, a very nice thing which uh, I still carried. He said, we started like this. And we did not have work, so we were struggling. Then one day a client came and he said, I want a Venetian house, can you do it for me? Since we had no work, we said, yeah, we'll do it. And they did this house in the Venetian style and it became a hit. Then more people started coming. Somebody said Moroccan house, so we would do a Moroccan house or anything. So he said, just time went on, we had enough work and after uh, we started charging a big fees, everything, still people kept coming. And then one day a guy came. He said, I have heard a lot about you. You do uh, good buildings. I leave it to you, whatever you like to do uh, and in this building. And he said, at that time, we actually, we didn't have an idea. So what he said was that it is good that you don't have projects, but you're sticking to your ideas. You are not letting them uh, fritter away. So this I carry in, uh, I mean, also I would like to uh, tell my students that early enough don't lose your good ideas and don't, don't fall for, uh, you know, quantum right in the beginning because one day they will, they will come back and say, okay, what, what do you think is good building? At that time you should, you should know what you have to offer.